Hi, I'm Kate Bonner for the Water Cooler Diaries on KBTV Online. Thanks for joining. To most people, an old license plate, it's just a piece of scrap metal. But to Aaron Foster, it is the beginnings of a business. He takes old license plates and he creates works of art, depicting everyone from chiseled cowboys to the voluptuous starlet, Marilyn Monroe. On today's Entrepreneur of the Month segment, we'll peer into Foster's world and we'll show how he went from managing a small home furnishing business to creating a multi-million dollar business out of what some say is scrap metal. Foster's story begins, like many stories do, with a girl struggling to find the perfect gift to woo his best friend and business partner, Margot. He turned to what he loved and knew, fond memories of childhood road trips and an attraction to found objects and antique school maps. The result? A map of the USA crafted entirely out of vintage license plates. His creation didn't win him Margot's affections, but it did catch her eye. With her encouragement, Foster crafted a second piece, then a third, and so began Aaron Foster Designs. There are now more than 40 designs in his collection, but his first creation, the USA map, has always been a signature piece. So what else does Foster make with these old license plates? His American collection feature flags, Lady Liberty, and USA maps. He has a whole collection devoted just to classic cars. There's also a transportation collection with taxis, planes, and a rocket ship. Some of his most popular works, however, are people like James Dean, Jim Morrison, Bob Dylan, even Mickey Mouse. Prints of his art cost about $315. Originals cost $4,000. He's been featured in the New York Times, LA Times, ABC, the San Francisco Chronicle, and Foster claims that his celebrity collectors include Dennis Quaid and Stephen Colbert. When he's not turning license plates into art, Foster is on TV. He is now the host and designer of the new HGTV show called Freestyle, which airs Friday at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Time. The show showcases room makeovers without spending any money, a playoff of Foster's talent for repurposing and making art out of everyday items. Perhaps as interesting as the pieces themselves is Foster's expectation for them. Here is what he had to say about his art. I always wonder about the history of the vintage plates I use, what roads they may have traveled down, and where they might be headed next, like the cars they once belonged to. I hope that my artwork will take fantastic journeys in the lives of their owners and always remind them of life's eternal sense of whimsy and adventure. Thanks for joining our Entrepreneur of the Month segment. I'm Kate Bonner for the Watercolor Diaries on KBTV Online.